Hello, this is an introduction to the Atlas for a City Region, imagining the post-Brexit landscapes of the Irish Northwest. The project's framed around three questions and presented here in a flexible format that can be read like a book, mounted on a wall like an exhibition, or laid out on a table. The first question is, is there a cross-border region in the Northwest? Students and researchers went to live in farms and villages and communities on both sides of the border, and we assembled 15 books of evidence that a region exists. For example, through shared public transport, such as the Swilly buses, we see a landscape on both sides of the border that could be understood as a distinct region. As circulation continues to increase, this cross-border mobility becomes even more important. The books of evidence include a range of topics from shared infrastructures to the linguistic and religious makeup of the region. The yellow color of the atlas comes from the wind bushes that cover the landscape and bloom for much of the year on both sides of the border. The second question is how to draw the region on a map. By drawing a region on a map, you create more borders. So we asked, can the region be represented by the lines that cross the border rather than by drawing new borders? By following food, we studied the flows of feed and milk through the Donald farm outside Straban, County Tyrone, that reveal a complex and convoluted set of cr not just cross-border, but cross-continental interactions. This representing the region map allows you to draw your own cross-border interactions on the map. The third question is, how will the region develop over the next 200 years or so? Here, we speculated on the future of the region. If we don't imagine the future, we have no ability to shape it. For example, can Calais on the Derry Donegal border be reimagined as a site for a future city of 1.5 million people? Students proposed a new city with street and road networks informed by the field patterns. By combining landscape and housing in radically different ways, you can provide new ways of living together. While Brexit will have an impact on the landscape, climate change is a more pressing concern. Within our lifetimes, the region will most likely experience a Mediterranean climate combined with a significant reduction in rainfall. Field patterns might change to accommodate new farming practices and irrigation systems. The Northwest will, will no longer be ideal for potatoes. Oranges and citrus fruits could become the new norm. With such expected changes, it's imperative to imagine new ways of working and inhabiting the land. In summary, we asked three questions. Is there a cross-border region in the Irish Northwest? Yes, clearly there is. Two, how to draw the region on a map? Well, by drawing the connections across the border rather than by drawing new borders. And three, how will the region develop over the next 200 years? Well, we can never know for sure, but we can speculate on different scenarios. If we don't imagine the future, we can't shape it. And all of this is summarized in one sentence. The border is not a line, it is a landscape. <laughs>